Teen Titans is one of the most beloved superhero team across many genres. Primarily known to many through their animated shows, but they obviously started in the comics. And they even had a live adaptation, which is one of my favorite shows of all time. But what if the Teen Titans became Pokemon? This is Periverse. Let's go! What is up everyone? Doc Perry here and I'm very excited for this episode because as I've said in the intro, I love the HBO show Titans. So shout out to Titans. <laughs> for th- and for those who liked his comment from the last video because we are using exactly this team for this episode. The Teen Titans. Um, presenting Robin... Uh, rumbling or fighting type with inner focus, with moves, quick attack, seismic toss, peck, smoke screen. This is Starfire, a dragon and fire type, I believe. With solar power, with Dackle, Sunny Day, and Ember. Definitely not the best moves yet, but this is definitely a busted one, nevertheless. Next is BB or Beast Boy, which involves two, like, how many evolutions does he get again? You know what? Just subscribe to the channel so you'll know more about this dude. But this is essentially our EV for Pokemon Multiverse. Right now, it has a Wimp out. So, it has moves uh, like Tail Whip, Growl, Helping Hand, and Sand Attack. No attacking moves. So, I don't think we're gonna use it for this boss fight yet. Um, this is Cyborg. Uh, with Steel type and Sturdy ability, which I can change to download, which is its hidden ability, I believe, with Pound, Spark, Charge, and Thunder Wave. Um, next one is a Raven, Ravenite, a Psychic Dark type, which I'm r- really contemplating of changing to Psychic and Ghost type. Let me know in the comment section if, if you think that's fine, because the game needs more Ghost types than Dark types. Anyway. It has Cursed Body with Will-O-Wisp, Confusion, Hex, and Phase Through. This is definitely our strongest member so far right now. And uh, last but definitely not the least, arguably my favorite one just because he's a a water type. But Ravenite is also up there with Swift Sim ability with Tackle, Bubble, Growl, and Soak. Okay, last episode we ended directly in front of the first mini boss fight so um this is gonna be a double battle so i'm thinking who to send huh perhaps i should have decided if i'm gonna change raven to ghost type yet before i started recording but hey um who are we sending Bulbasaur, Starem, um, you know what? Let's bring Robling. And the reason why I'm really scared with this boss fight is it has um, War Machine with Skill Link. Pin Missile Skill Link. So, anyway, let's start this fight. I'm always the first one here to train. Before anyone knows about this place, I was the first one here. Ho, oh, I'm Ryan. That's just something I say to intimidate bad guys. I've been practicing the same mean stuff for when I graduate from being a sidekick. But, yeah. <laughs> um, okay, this is a, a, a side team. This is War Machine and Bucky. Oh! <laughs> Sorry for that back sprite. I'm gonna change that after this one. Ooh! Maybe I should Will Wisp the War GM. I'm scared. 
I'm gonna switch out Ravenite and I'm gonna Ember the Warzim. Because for those who don't know, this is a Nuzlocke run, which I am really, really thinking of switching back to a normal. Nice! Ember, let's go! I'm never worried. I'm sorry for my voice, guys. It's I know it's very, like, congested. <laughs> I'm still sick. But I really wanted to record this video for you guys. Okay. Helping hand doesn't really work with seismic toss. So that's... That's such a blunder for you. Ooh, the para. Okay. Uh huh. I think we got this in the bag. After this, we head to Route 102, I believe. Because last episode, if you ha if, if you haven't watched that yet, I, I highly suggest that you watch that first. Uh, I'm gonna put the the link into the comment section down below. I mean, to the description box down below. But anyway, okay, we got our first mini boss win, thankfully with no deaths. <laughs> And we increase our level cap to level 11? I'll just edit it. Also, um, if you want to like suggest a team for our, our next episode, you may do so by commenting down below what team you want us to use anyway i'll just fix that fix that back sprite very quick okay i think i got that fixed and as i was saying the earlier you leave your team suggestion the higher chance of people actually liking your comment and I, I'm, I'm um gonna use the most liked the team suggestion with the most likes on the next episode that's how this series is gonna be um i'll try to keep it that way hopefully you don't you don't get tired of commenting what team, teams you want me to use <laughs> um and since the game actually promises 400 plus pokemon variants based of uh, marvel and dc characters there's a good chance there's actually there's actually a good chance that you um that your five favorite character will be in the game, so try it. <laughs> Fire away. Um. Oh no, I don't. I still don't have a fighting type move yet. That's um what you have to wait <laughs> and watch until the end of the episode to see what moves this Team Titans learn when we're like. Level 11? Okay. Catin is down. Oh, that, that was a DC dip cut. Like, Catwoman versus Robin? You don't really see that much. Th that a lot. Uh... Okay. This is... Um, Black Widow. This is Natasha Romanoff. I'm still in the process of like changing some of the trainer's Pokemon. But I haven't had the time to do it yet. Uh -huh. I think we're gonna breeze through Route 102 because... Level 8 is fair, fairly high for them. Okay, this is Skadal. One of the most vicious Pokemon <laughs> in the game, if you guys don't know. 
because of that move. It always hit me five times. And that, I jinxed it. <laughs> That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to jinx it. Oh, this is Morph from X-Men. The, the Scaddle one is Scarlet Spider. Uh, yeah, that's nothing. Oh. Uh, also, for those who don't know, or maybe you're not really familiar with Teen Titans, this is... Flakwa is based from Aqualad, right? His name is Aqualad, right? Now I'm questioning myself. <laughs> anyway, uh, huh? we are done with this trainer. Okay. It's hard to like Train BB because he doesn't have any move attacking move. Uh, it has sand attack and whip out. So I'll try to use that. My short legs are tired from walking. Let's have a battle. This is um Snubble, the pre evo for Pokemon Cable. Do you guys know Cable? Cable from Marvel, from X-Men. BB is a rubber type. Um, for obvious reason, I I initially um gave it a normal type before I implemented the rubber type for the game, but yeah. There's a lot of characters that would fit rubber types. Um, Beast Boy for one. Fantastic. Uh, Mr. Fantastic also. He's gonna miss a lot. Uh, who else? Morph is one. Mystique is one. Uh, he can't even hit me now. Oh, that didn't even. Okay. Okay. Okay, so he's using um, Confusion. So I think Ravenite is a good choice here. Yeah. You are a Psychic and Steel type. I can, I can Hex you. That animation though. Nightshade. Do I want Nightshade? I think I have a, a pretty good move set for now. Phase through is a custom move. This is a basically double team with plus one priority. So I think I'm gonna keep what I have right now. Okay, so far, I'm really enjoying the team. Like, really, really enjoying the team. Uh-huh. Let's fight the two remaining trainers here. In Route 102. Senfred is... Alfred. Can you guys see its mustache? <laughs> I wonder if it, there's any like... Um... Ooh. Ooh. There's any like interaction between Beast Boy and Alfred in any comics or any show? 
Like, they're both related to Robin. So. Okay. He's continued using. is is continuing to use Nuzzle. Uh huh. Robin still doesn't have a, a good move. Oop. That's a crit. <laughs> I knew it. Okay. That's... Oh, no. That sucks. I'm not gonna spend... More time fighting you, I'm gonna send out Starfire. It's fine, it's fine. Solar power with uh sunny day. Early in the game is is a two-edged sword. This is a um, green arrow from DC also. Oh no, I used my orange berry. I didn't mean to use that. You can be playmates. Okay, we can be playmates. Uh... And the last trainer for Route 102. After this, we go head. We go straight to what what map is that? Spider's Den. Which um is a place you're gonna enjoy a lot if if you love Spider-Man or a Spider-Verse. Take down that PB, and we're done with this map. Okay, uh, let's go to our sister first before we. Dang it! Oh, you're a cute one. <laughs> this is Wild Gut from DC. Um, I wish I know you guys loves the game if, if you're watching it up to this point I know you love um, either either you love Marvel or you love DC or you love both or you love Pokemon you just love a new fan game but if you guys have friends whom you might think would love this project it will it would help me a lot if you're gonna share it to them share this video to them okay we have scaddle again here it's totally fine um regarding poison I kind of implemented the the recent mechanics where Outside of battle, poison doesn't kill. It leaves you on what on one HP. Do you guys like that? Do you guys like um having the scare of, of leaving your poison Pokemon like with one HP or you just want them like, <laughs> almost dead? Uh huh. Who is it again? Okay, Scorpion is here. I am so congested. Is 
Starium is actually gonna cook in this map. Being a fire and dragon type, no one can touch her. Uh, imagine if he dies. <laughs> yeah, that's that's what I was saying. Okay, let's go back. Oh, these two trees are bugged. Uh -huh. It's hard to train BB. I don't understand why people get scared when I show them my Pokemon team. What's your Pokemon team? And I'm gonna judge if it's scary. Lednum. This is Venom. So... I can totally understand why why they say your theme is scary. <laughs> if you like send that out in, in a family gathering or your, your friends sleep over that's gonna scare some people. And Redinja. Oh I can't say if he's scary or he's just Creep. I see the the tattered wings though. So, that's sad, if anything. Okay. They are scary, right? Uh. I honestly, can't say. I'm gonna bring my Pokemon to. Oh no, man. No. I mean, yeah, sure. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Speaking of Venom, he's here. And we well, we can catch it. If you guys want me to use Venom, comment down below. I'll train BB. Okay. Uh huh. BB learned Vine Whip, which is still not optimal but hey that's that's what he got okay i should probably teach i should probably give it like tackle or something early in the game because it doesn't make sense if bb doesn't learn anything lore wise or probably bite but at least tackle right When I grow up, I want to work at the Daily Bugle. Daily Bugle is um, a map in the game, obviously, which is a combination of Daily Planet and James Jonah Jameson's company, which I always forget. Something Bugle. Oh, you are a poison type? Using Ravenite against this bug types is scary. I just noticed that. Because I'm part psychic type. Okay, this is just... Why do you have a starter? <laughs> fake out, okay. I expect the fake out. If I was ghost type, I would have been Gucci. But I'm not yet a ghost. Okay, we're level 10 now. Hey. My son has a ton of this in the room. You can have some. Oh. <laughs> what are silver powder, guys? What is what, what is that? I mean, in real world, what is that? Because my dad built my for me. Because um, what other 
like type based item do we have in the game we have charcoal we have mystic water i don't know if if there's any like um specific thing that is called mystic water we have never melt ice we have what else um what do we, electrizer no that's that's an evolution item um what else do we have i should switch out now okay this is the, the the pokemon before this one is miles morales and this one is spider gwen you know what this is the last pokemon starium will take now oh okay that did nothing this is a cool b fight though starfire versus spider gwen I mean, Spider Gwen will definitely hold her own. She's not a bum. I'm not sure if she can beat, like, Starfire, but. Okay, let's just grab this items. And heal up. But. This is Groot. You know what? Um, you see this guy? Like, this guy? This guy? That's the next boss we're gonna fight on the next episode. And this is all... This is, this is it for this episode, guys. Um, again, comment down what team you want me to use on the next episode. And like if there's any suggestions that you like also. Um, yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for all the patience and support that you guys are giving me all the love. Doc Perry out. Keep safe, guys. Bye.